Today's tutorial is on an eyeshadow inspired greeting card. This is the final product and I'm giving this to my cousin who loves, 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 loves makeup. So let's get started. I used a one inch puncher, a square with decorative edges. For this part, you're gonna wanna use your scrap paper. You're gonna need three different shades of the color pink, purple, orange and or golden yellow, blue, green, and you want three shades of glitter paper. Punch out your shape and you should have a total of 18 pieces. I laid them out the way that I planned on gluing them to my card, but you can feel free to organize them in any way you want to. Use a metallic pen or marker and outline all the edges around the punch out. Make sure to complete this process for all 18 pieces. I chose a black card that was four and a quarter inches by five and a half inches and a white envelope. Take a corner punch and round off all four corners. Find your embellishments. I cut a light blue piece of paper one inch by five and a half inches and that's where my happy birthday sticker will go and I also use some pink rhinestones and a makeup applicator. I use clear tacky glue and a sponge and I lightly glue down all 18 punch outs and the light blue border. After you're done gluing the pieces down, this is what it should look like. I placed the happy birthday sticker in the center. If you want straighter lines, you can definitely use a ruler, but I kind of just winged it. When you're finished with this process, before you put down your embellishments, you're gonna wanna put this card in between parchment paper. So parchment paper should be in the front and the back of the card, and then you're gonna cover it and stick it inside a hardback book so that the weight will press down on the card and make it flat. You're ready to put on your final touches and basically you can make this your own and embellish it the way that you want. I use pink rhinestones and a makeup applicator. Like with all crafts, just be mindful of everything that you're using. A lot of these embellishments are small, so make sure you read the warning labels. Make sure all the embellishments and everything else that you put on the card is age appropriate for the person that you're giving it to. Finally, here's my inspiration, a real makeup kit, and this is the completed product of my card. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Have a great day. As always, please feel free to share your arts and crafts tips and tricks. Thanks again for watching everyone and have a great day.